You are watching Coin Collecting Fun. You are so awesome. Coin Collecting Fun, where it is all about you. You and more. You. Coin Collecting Fun, the king of hobbies and the hobby of kings. It's not about me. It's not about my. It's not about mine. It's about you. And that is why this video is designed especially for you. So let's look through $500 and $10 bills together, focusing primarily on the serial numbers to see if we find any unique notes. And after this video is over, check out the link below this video in the description section to see a cool coin from the Philippines. That video currently has over 850 likes. Let's see if we can get that video to over 1,000 likes. So that is the most liked video on coin collecting fun. Let's see if we can get more and more likes on that video. If you enjoy this type of content, coin collecting and currency hunting, go ahead and crush the like button, the subscribe button, and when subscribing, tap the notifications bell to be notified of future coin collecting fun videos just as soon as they're uploaded to YouTube. So I just got $500 in tens out of an ATM, and these are flat, crisp, fresh, wonderful smelling notes they just smell so new and they have that beautiful money smell and uh, I'm not sure why people call it cold hard cash because it's not it's not cold it's warm and it's not hard it's soft it's warm and it's soft it's not cold hard cash and it just smells so good I just want to take this top bill off this stack right here and just smell it man that smells good and it looks like we might have sequential notes these notes are literally pool table flat and crisp and uh, they don't look like they've ever been in contact with human skin they look like they were just printed yesterday even though the date on them is 2017 and at the time of this video production it is 20 21 so these notes basically were printed one right after the other and uh, so you can see the note in front the serial number is 20461226 and I'm just gonna read the last four digits of each number or I should say each serial number so we see the note in front just read that entire serial number with the last four being one, two, two, six. And then the one right behind it is one, two, two, five. So these were literally printed one right after the other. These were all printed at the same time. And these are most definitely uncirculated. There's just been so many times I've gone to the ATM, withdrawn $500 in $10 bills, and they're folded, they're crinkled, they're old, they're kind of worn out these are like the complete opposite these are just uh, absolutely beautiful brilliant and like I said clean crisp and smells like money it smells like clean money it has that money smell whatever chemicals are used and just for your information you may already know this but even though people think notes like these are made out of paper which they probably partially are they're also made out of, I think, a cotton fabric blend. Because other, otherwise, if these were just ordinary paper, they would not hold up very long at all in circulation. If you can imagine how quickly paper would break down or, you know, rip or tear, you know. So the note behind 1225 is 1224, definitely sequential, and indicating that these are uncirculated and printed one right after the other. Let's see what the next note is. Sure enough, one, two, two, three. These are all sequential so far. Pure, clean, crisp, beautiful, sweet smelling money. Not cold hard cash. It's warm and soft. And we can see one, two, two, two right behind there. Followed by one, two, two, one. Followed by one, two, two, zero. The next number will most likely be one, two, one, nine. 
And it surely is. Followed by 1218. And just as a reminder, after this video is over, check out the link below this video in the description section to see a cool coin from the Philippines. That video is currently the most viewed video on coin collecting fun with over 60,000 views. Let's see if we can get that video to over 100,000 views. Next number is probably going to be 1217. Followed by 1618. Okay, so that is no longer sequential, but we had a nice run of sequential notes there. So we see the last four, 1618, followed by 1617, so it's sequential again. 1616, maybe the next number will be 1615. And it certainly is. Followed by 1614. 1613. Probably going to be 1612. Yep, 1612. Six one 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 six one zero one six zero nine one six zero eight one six zero seven one six zero six one six zero five 1604, 1603, 1602, 1601, 1600, and of course uh, 1599. So continuing on, reading the last four digits of these serial numbers. 1598 1597 1596 Next one's probably going to be 1595 Indeed it is 1594 Bet you the next one's going to be 1593 Absolutely. 1592. 1591. 1590. 1589. 1588. Wow, these are just crisp and clean. Privilege to handle. Definitely a very nice feeling on the fingertips. 1587, 1586, 1585, 1584, 1583, 1582, 1581. Bet you the next one's going to be 1580. Yeah, 1580, followed by 1579. That's the last one. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And check out the link below this video in the description section to see a cool coin from the Philippines. Again, that is the most viewed video on this channel. And it has over 2,300 comments. Let's see if we can get that video to over 5,000 comments. So it has the most views, the most likes, and the most comments out of any video on this channel. So drop a like on that video. Check out the link and leave as many comments as you'd like.